Thank you. Uh, thank you, uh, Ted, for that very kind introduction. And it is, as he said, so good to be here. Uh, but before I get started on my remarks, it's my duty to inform you all that, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have a situation. All right. As you may know, there's a new fighter pilot movie coming out now with Tom Cruise. All right. Some of you may have heard about it. Some of you who wear the wings of gold may have watched the trailer. Nasty Manazer told me he's watched it 36 times. <laughs> but one of the benefits of being the chief of naval operations is that I'm given advanced warning of some of these Hollywood sketches and releases. And as it turns out, I was just leaked a copy of the script for a follow-on movie that's being filmed as we speak, Top Gun Slapshot. I want to bring you back now, if you could, take a journey with me back to Miramar in the mid-80s. Here's the scene. Trailer, it's misty, right? Some June gloom there out in the uh, San Diego area. You look off to the horizon, an F-14 Alpha, wing swept, appears on the horizon, flying low and fast. Comes into view and passes the camera. You see VF-14 top hatters painted on the side, and a bell tolls ominously. There's a bunch of aviators at the O Club. When the CO comes in and the music stops, the CO barks out, Rat, Jaws, Timbo, Birdie, Slapshot. You're to depart immediately to a destination that I can't tell you about now or I'd have to kill you. <laughs> you'll get the details of your mission when you arrive, Slapshot, you'll link up with your pilot on the ship. And if you actually need someone to really fly the plane, uh, hell, I'll fly it for you myself. <laughs> the scene shifts out to a nuclear-powered supercarrier underway in a dangerous place. You can feel the tension in the air. Slap shots in front of the CAG's desk. And behind the desk sits a figure shrouded in shadows and secrecy, talking. 30-plus years of service. Combat medals. Hell, 11 rows of combat medals. Citations, the Gray Owl Award, and no gray hair. 2016 arrested landings from the back seat. You got, you got a 2.4 GPA in oceanography and somehow passed. <laughs> and still you somehow pass nuclear power school. The only Naval Academy superintendent to serve five consecutive years at Annapolis here. Slapshot, for God's sake, by now you should be a six-star admiral. And yet, you're here. Why is that? Slapshot responds, CNO, that's just one of life's mysteries. All right? Well, all right, so uh, coming to a theater near you. <laughs>